This is the fifth video in a series designed to help you learn how to use the Family Search Research Wiki. Here are just some samples of the kinds of topics you'll find under the research process. Using appropriate forms, how to gather information from your family homes and through interviews, organizing your records, how to select the easiest research objective out of all your different lines, how to keep a research log, recording the results of what you find in records, and how to label those carefully, and evaluating the evidence to make sure you make wise decisions about who your ancestors were. I'm going to use this URL to go directly to the Research Process section of the wiki, and this URL will be listed in the notes below the video. This is the main page of the Research Process. The research process articles are all organized around this cycle. The cycle seems very simple to identify what you need to know, decide what you want to learn, choose records to search, search them, and then use the information. However, we could then take this process and break each of those steps down into subskills each of which could be taught in a way to make you even better at that subskill. At the bottom of each article in this research process section, you will find what we call an info bar that has links to all of these subskills so that you can jump from skill to skill and study the ones that you feel you most need. I'd like to show you an example of an article, and I think the important skill I'd like to start with is gathering family information. If you are just beginning genealogy, you need a firm base in gathering records that might be found in your home or homes of your relatives, and in interviewing your older relatives to find out what they know about their ancestors. This article will give you suggestions of all the types of family records and documents that you could find in your own home that could help with genealogy. It will tell you how to prepare for an interview and how to interact and communicate with your living relatives. I'd like now to show you an important way of navigating through the wiki. If you look down here, at the bottom of every page, you will see categories. Every wiki article is assigned a category, and by clicking on that category, you can find a list of links to other similar articles. There are many other articles on this topic written by other contributors, and we find them by looking in the category. For example, here is an article on creating a personal history. I like this article because it has about 1,800 questions that are designed to help revive memories when writing a personal history. I'm going to use the info bar at the bottom of these research process pages to take you to another article that I think is very important for every genealogist to read. And it's called Evaluate the Evidence. There's a lot of information in this article on how to effectively weigh the evidence you've found and using the genealogical proof standard to make sure that the conclusion you've reached is as accurate as possible. It's a very important concept and a very important article, and you should read it and master it. Now you try it. If you're just getting started on your genealogy, read the article, gather family information. Everyone should be an expert at evaluating the evidence, so I strongly suggest that you read that article. And then browse through all the other topics in the research process and notice the ones that you think you personally might need. 